I'm gonna show you my top five exercises for building strength in Jiu Jitsu. Let's get started. Let's start off with my favorite exercise from this list, the cross body hammer curl. The reason this exercise is so good is because it helps you build insane choking power. If you look at the position your arm is in during any choke, you always have at least one arm curled in this exact position. And if you add a 10 second isometric hold at the top, then you're going to be building the strength required to prevent your arm from being pulled down. Another way to visualize it is like this. Imagine two individuals arm wrestling. One is trying his hardest to bring his opponent's hand down while the other holds his arm in a static position, ensuring he does not lose any ground, but also not making any attempt to gain ground. Who do you think will get tired first? Exactly. The person spending all his energy trying to progress. Once this person gets tired and his bicep is burning, then his opponent will have an easier time pushing forward. The same applies to a rear naked choke. If your choking arm is strong in a static position, then it's only a matter of time until the person you're choking gets tired. And that's when you progress. Even Gordon Ryan has said that he doesn't make an attempt to go for the choke immediately. When you perform this exercise, be sure to hold the dumbbells at the top for 10 seconds after you do your reps. Next up on this list is a squat variation called a Zercher Squat. The Zercher Squat will help you build the necessary power needed for lifting your opponent. It also puts you in a similar enough position to replicate these movements. This one exercise will help build strength in your legs and in your back. Be careful because this exercise has one dangerous side effect. Once you start mat returning your teammates, they're going to start accusing you of juicing. The next exercise is a push-up variation, diamond push-ups. If you look at the position you are in when you are in bottom side control and you are about to push your opponent off of you, you will see that it looks similar to a diamond push-up, which is why I think this is such an important exercise for chest and triceps. If these are too easy for you and you want to make them an even better exercise, then do explosive diamond push-ups. Can you see why? When you push your opponent away, it's always in a short explosive push, which means doing these explosive push-ups will replicate that exact movement. Next we have Dragon Flag. If you have weak abs, that most likely means that your guard is going to get easily passed because you'll have difficulty bringing your knees to your chest and maintaining them there. A lot of Jiu Jitsu athletes completely neglect training their abs. I myself noticed a huge difference in my guard retention and specifically when I was inverting because when someone did happen to pass my guard, that's when I would invert. And when I invert, that's when my abs and my entire core is engaged. Not just getting to that position, but maintaining that position as long as I need to. The longer you hold it, the more your abs burn. Do yourself a favor and just train your core. Now onto the final exercise, hip thrusts. This exercise is so important for Jiu Jitsu strength training that I had to change this video name from originally being four exercises to five exercises just so I can add it in there. Hip thrusts train your glutes which are most commonly used when you bridge. If you constantly do hip thrust with a weight that's light enough for you to be explosive but heavy enough for you to barely get five reps in then you will see how powerful your bridging will be in Jiu Jitsu. Of course, you can change the rep range however you'd like. This is just my preference. You don't want to neglect training your glutes, trust me. If you found this video helpful, then please do me a huge favor and leave a like. And if you found any value in this video, then please, please, please consider subscribing to my channel. It means a lot to me, it helps me out a lot and it would be awesome if I could do this full time. If you enjoyed this video and want to see another video showing another five set of exercises that are good for Jiu Jitsu, I have more than 10 exercises that I couldn't cram into this video, so I would be more than happy to do more. Just comment more down below to let me know and I'll do another video. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Oh, before you go, I work as the professional videographer for a super awesome action pack super fight event called Arte Suave elite so if you want to watch fun vlogs that are really entertaining that show you behind the scenes of what goes on and you get to meet the team and see all the goofiness that goes on behind uh, setting up for the event then watch this video here for some good laughs thank you so much i'll see you guys in the next video